All right, folks, so average Joe here that loves the Lord, Jesus Christ. Hey, I said the name this time for that person that continuously commented on uh, my video saying I didn't say the name Jesus, so uh, that's okay. The interpretation of my rapture dream was simple. The bike was my work for the Lord. When I got to the dump and my legs were extremely tired, that's me now, being tired and weary. The bag of trash was all my burdens. And I had to throw that bag away before I could turn. As you notice in the dream, I said that. I pushed, forcefully pushed the bag into that small little opening and then turned around and said, I'm ready, Lord. So my burdens were thrown away. It was simple. Sometimes it takes days, sometimes it'll take a week, but I always get the interpretation to every dream that I have. You know, I had a, a guy comment on uh, my rapture dream video and he said that he is a prophet. And he said, I am a prophet. I'm going to interpretate your dream. And he said something about, uh, it's money that I'm holding on to. Let me tell y'all something. <laughs> You know, as Paul says, I know what it's like to have plenty and I know what it's like to have little. <clears throat> I've been rich in my life, well, financially rich, back in 2001. And I've also been homeless in 2009. And I will say this, I have never, ever cared about or held on to money. So what I would say to that person is they're a false prophet which we all need to be aware of. Anyone who gives himself a title, be aware of that anyway, especially when they're proud of it. Um, there is also a lot of Debbie Downers in the church who are so miserable in their lives, they bash other Christians instead of listening to any message. They'd rather focus on what the person's wearing they'd rather focus on the person is unshaven whatever the case may be they focus on everything other than the message and then they bash that person on every aspect of everything that's what I call a Debbie Downer I've never given myself a title frankly I don't deserve any of it but um Jesus is coming soon, whether anybody likes it or not. People can, you know, text me books of trying to explain to me how Paul was a false prophet. I've had this stuff. People can text me notebooks, books. It doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. I'm not going to listen to what man says. I know how to read the Bible. I know how to understand the Bible. It's called the Holy Spirit. If someone else can't understand it, then that's not my problem. I'm doing what I'm supposed to do is what I'm trying to say. As, as many should be doing. We're all getting tired. I understand that. I'm tired too. I'm weary too. But we got to continue. No breaks. Time is up, y'all. God bless it.